Okay, so can't make it to the game tonight. Down in London working. Um, I was cancelled. I thought, oh, maybe I can make it up the road. But then 10 minutes later, I get another message saying, can you cover another job? So I'll be starting work at 2300. Um, when I got back in time, no way from Scunthorpe. Probably faster drove in my car. So uh, I'm going to try and watch it on iFollow and um, see what happens. Hopefully we can pick something up um, after the good result against Morecambe on Saturday. Should be a good game. Both teams down there, both wanting wins. So, yeah, hopefully you all have a good night watching it if you're there. And if you're not there, well, it can't be helped, can it, sometimes? So, But I will be at Walsall. So I'm going to do a bit of chatting while I'm watching the game, see what happens. Bit of a different vibe. Much rather be at the game. Okay, so I might not be at the game, but I've got it on iFollow um, before I start work tonight. And already, Oldham had a chance there in the first minute. Within the first minute, really. It's a good chance as well. If they'd have kept it down, could have been in trouble there. Um, but yeah, so not at the game. So it's obviously not the same as when you're watching it on TV or a little screen on my tablet. But um, yeah, why not? Might as well do the vlog from, from my hotel, hasn't I? Could have been a break there, it was a three on one, seventh minute, and um, Van Veen didn't see him, well he did see him in the end, but um, but it was going the opposite way from where they, they were anyway, but it was a good chance, we just picked the corner up, but Oldham have looked bright, I'll be honest with you, the first five, six minutes or so, they've looked really bright, so a lot quicker, seems to be quicker, more attacking, but hopefully it's just a ten minute spell, and we'll um, get back into the game, go on. Another corner. Looks to be about 100, 120 Oldham fans in the crowd. Maybe a bit more. Just can't see all the all the ground there on the screen. Oh, too deep that corner. Well, it's been all Oldham. Then Scunthorpe had a good spell. Now it's all Oldham again. So bit end to end. It's one of those games that you wish you were at, actually there in person watching, um, just so you can see the other bits on the pitch as well. Because obviously on the iPlayer. I follow even, I play, I follow, um, you're only seeing certain bits of the um, pitch, so you don't get to see all the players, but it looks a good game, I'll be honest, I'm only 11 minutes in. Oh, as you can see, I follow as per normal, is absolutely garbage, um, yeah, nothing on the screen, it's just crashed, twice now within 16 minutes, oh the joys. Okay, so I'm still waiting for iFollow to uh, load back up. Um, for the past seven minutes, it's just been crashed. It's tried loading, and um, as per normal, it's rubbish. Well, that's the uh, screen right now, as you can see. Just waiting for it to uh, load up. Over the joys, probably turn it back on, and we'll be either winning 2 0 or losing 2 0. Okay, so still not got iPlayer on. Just um, it's nearly half time now. Um, it's a joke, really, if you're trying to watch it, if you're abroad or whatever, and it crashes like this all the time. Yeah, hopefully, those that are there are enjoying the game. Still nil nil last time I checked. Um, and like I say, the first, what I did see the first 16 minutes or so, it was like spells of pressure from either team. Um, Oldham start with, then Scunthorpe, then Oldham. So I don't know what it's been like through the rest of the game, so I've not been watching it, have I? So hopefully, we can keep a clean sheet and. Well, yeah, hopefully we can just win. I see Walsall beating Morecambe. We've got Walsall next um, on Saturday. I will be at that game. Uh, I'm going to hook up with Seb, who's a um, Walsall fan. Get a few thoughts from him on the team, on how he thinks the game will go. OK, so I'm just sat, um, been sorting work out for later on. And um, my tablet's buzzed twice at me while I'm doing it, thinking nothing of it. Just clicked it on now. And I see that we're losing 2-0. Um, two quick goals for Oldham. <sighs> I don't know how we've been playing. I saw the first 16 minutes after that. I thought it was just crashed for me. Probably a good thing. Bit of a blow, isn't it? Um, good win at the weekend. But like I said, that first half, 3-0 up. But second half, we sat off. And uh, Morecambe looked like they could have scored any time, really, if they'd have got some shots in. Um, papered over some cracks. And, um, yeah, same team as well. 
that played on Saturday is playing tonight. I, I like I say, I can't judge. I'm not there watching, but it is disappointing to see that we're two 0 down. Um, we've obviously switched off at some point for some reason, and we've let Oldham, well, score two goals basically. Yeah, disappointing. So I'm just putting a clip together to put on a video um, of the chances Scunthorpe had on the on the BBC, the four chances before Oldham scored their two goals, and my tablet beeps again. And I'm thinking, oh, not 3-0, but no, Matty Lund scored, it's 2-1 now, 67th minute. Can we get something out of this game? It'd be amazing if we did, being 2-0 down. Um, fingers crossed we do, still time, plenty of time to do it. So why not, let's go for it. Absolutely buzzing, 2-0 down, 2 all. I'll take that all day long. But I think, you know, showing a bit of character there to come back into the game. And I read that Van Veen got booked for over exuberation and celebration. So what, do I care? Do I chuff? 2-2, um, another point picked up. Um, a win last Saturday. Hopefully we go to Warsaw and get something from there. That'll be a good test for us. For a little uh, mini revival, I guess you could call it. Um, yeah, really happy with that. 2-2. Two, two. If you want to check out a video of somebody that was there, um, Reese Parsons, he's an Oldham fan. Um, he was at the game, he's done a vlog. I'll put the link in below so you can see that if you want to see it from the other side. And... Um, yeah, see you all at Warsaw. Bring it on.